hello everyone and what is going on Hyperion Blue GT here time to get ready to go for today's lap time challenge on Gran Turismo 7 since last time when we were using with the Honda NSX 2017 at Daytona International Speedway on World Course to be in the night time but the time condition is about to be set to go by having a late midnight to go again as we're about to choose with a Porsche 911 GT3 RS Type 992-2022 will be going in by having a good use of regulation by having a hard racing compound tires with a BOP slash tuning prohibited to go for having a high speed. Here's a tip. When it comes to have straightaways and go faster because of the active wing spoiler to be equipped and used by having a drag reduction system. This will be having a very good excellent tool that you might need to catch up and make your mark for having a good settlement to have a good ejected on the go whenever you might need to go hard for having a good perfect line. But better watch yourself because two types of penalty settings are about to be set by invalidate by having a shortcut and wall collision. Better make sure that you might need to test your skill and do your best out there when using with a type 992-911 GT3 RS. A very good find additional to have a good features to have some full customization to have a good hyper performance. So gonna be ready up and have UDRS ins protect livery to be entered so I'll have to be set and go for the regulation by having a reduce of horsepower by 517 and weight to be stationed remains in 3197 pounds. So as always if you're new to my youtube channel be sure click the subscribe button then leave a like and comment at the session down below check out the links on the description if you want to see more don't forget to click the bell for notification on upcoming content videos in the later future. Let's get ready to go and start for today's lap time challenge. Let's begin. So I just went down to do some minor changes for my full walkthrough videos when I go live streaming. But it takes patience until being updated for exactly for having a long duration for only 8 hours so I had to go down to do some management. So my channel is about to be going on for having a major step of industry development to be on stage of production. So I'll have to get down for every part of the content video to be served as a marathon that when it comes to have a lap time challenge. Gonna have to go down and do some global ranking to have a good set of the replay icon and here is right over here. Thunder underscore hefty that just took by a minute. 45.783 seconds to have a good different exact livery variation on the Type 992. Position to be at 1013 place. So I'll have to give it a go. Loading and successful. Then one session is about to be ready up and go dive in on the track to have a good corners and few straightaways to have a good use on drag reduction system. So here it comes, turning up the music, and drag reduction is at the go. So it might be possible when using the hard racing compound tires to the Type 992, there's going to take a lot of good speed, acceleration, and fuel braking to go finding a good line. If you really need to have a perfect line, now's the time to do it, and have the time will go commence. I'll have to get down and do the scouting position on the warm-up in first lap. Gonna have to change up the hood cam and go by the West Horseshoe at turn 3. There goes the International. Going to proceed and have that good straightaway. Up and go. Better watch yourself. International Horseshoe and the West might need to have some few hairpins to slow down without the DRS. Short straightaway might be quite very good to use before coming exit to be at turn 6 and 7 whenever you might need to go on the left. That's a good position. Now gonna have to take the next sector to be on number 3. A 
a bit more encouraging more improved acceleration and proceed to have a good elevation on the length gonna have to make one stop at the bus stop chicane careful don't get off the track to have an invalidate that is gonna be the only hot zone that we might need to be very extra careful So this will be having a good exact total time to be currently to have a minute and almost to be at 50 seconds. That's how you might need to go a bit more faster that you're really gonna have to try to keep your best. Here's the only first example by courtesy to have a minute 52.021 seconds that you might need to step up to go harder and faster if you really need to master the type 992. Just going to keep a good line follow up on turn 3 at the International. Ghost car is always meant to be well expert that you have to stay on the inside and make a good perfect line. But many times and many attempts from every previous video as I'm about to go on full major marathon. But man, it takes a long time and get settled in to have these kinds of piece of bunk release content work that needs to do some more trimming and updating. I'm just gonna have to keep trying to work hard. Okay, DRS is gonna have to be patient and go in full use for only a short amount. Okay, here it comes, diving in. Good, excellent position. Now it'll have to take final sector to go on the inside to have a good range of the gap to have almost three seconds. Here it is right now. Lap number two all the way to go enter to have the dirt lap. A bit more closer and that should be it to only, to only have one session. Wow, cannot believe I just took a good average time by a minute, 48.9 seconds. It takes a good thrill of match perfect to see this time is yet to be currently to have session number two. But it'll have to be stop for a moment and then it'll have to take a break until gonna have to go back again on to attempt two. So very good to have 9.2 miles after being finishing on the fourth week of weekly challenges. Time to go down on the results and see how five sectors are being highlighted in the green on lap number two. For only sector one, that brings out to have a 30.66 seconds as sector two to go onwards to be moving up by forward in 25.701 seconds during on, in the middle of sector three. 14.673 seconds is doing a bit much more work and climbing up to have a good set of speed, acceleration, and respond to the handling. And also for having sector 4 to have a good exact position to have a good bus stop chicane. 17.128 seconds. And for the final sector, in the fifth, 21.332 seconds. It brings the map and have the first session for having a good use of the best time by a minute 48.9 seconds is actually to have a good well match. So let's tally up the outcome results and place on the silver. Just only have 1.4 seconds to have a good step of requirement that you might need to get pushing up a little bit more harder. But the match is perfect and positioned to be at 57,833rd place. But in the meantime, just try your lap and finish your run to have a good capable to have the type 992 if you really need to have some good skills to have a good usage 
on every corners including the International and West Horseshoe along with some few corners and straightaways and even the bus stop is definitely your best part of the offense. Okay, back on the track for session 2. Then let's give a good high speed acceleration on the drag reduction system. If you're really gonna have to do it for having one good speed handling and acceleration, just give a good flow response to the steering whenever you might need to keep a good drag reduction to stay on hold for having a good increased amount of acceleration. Take the first turn before the timer will begin to have a good usage, for instance. Okay, there we go. Now crossing through on turn two. International Horseshoe on turn three. Okay, but this may be having a little bit more tricky to have the next sector on number two. Okay, gonna have to stay on the apex. Better not to get off the track. Alright. Now just wait. Third sector is gonna be your best position to go increase on the high speed acceleration when you're on the inside. But just yet to be temporary if you're feeling nervous without any full response on the DRS. But it's okay. It takes more practice that you have to do some more matter of experience. Once you clear sector 4, you have to take sector 5 to give it what you got and push your boundaries that you might need to keep a good speed of use. So here comes the best full stretch. Almost to have a minute and 47 seconds that you need to step up to go by the update. So that's .633. Not yet so far, but it'll have to skip by forward to do the next clip to have this one is currently to go on over. Now watch this to see how my ghost car can actually gonna have to do the same trick I just recently took by the first. But it'll have to take two hairpins to go by the right turns is gonna have to keep much more fine precisely to have this ghost car right over here. See? Almost getting off the track by touching the apex. It sure does might be going a high risk. Now going up or having a good 0.2 seconds. Next step of requirement and keep going on to the right side of the track in the long straight. Okay. Good thing mastering the bus stop is going to be a bit more tricky that you guys really need to master this skill. Only for the Type 992, it can actually to hold the good line and have the DRS to be on standby until going to make a good launch and then the final sector in number 5 to have a good stretch to be entered in. And there you go. New record and update by having 1 minute, 47.265 seconds. Nearly there to be climbing up on the goal and that should be doing well excellent to have a short run for only 3 laps in 2 sessions. So let's check again, and my record is doing perfectly to have a good gold medal ejected. But in the meantime, I'll have to come back again before tomorrow until the next lap time challenge along with a group 3 category at the Big Willow in Willow Springs International <laughs> Raceway.
but I'm really sure of it that we'll be doing much more fine the progress and development for having a major marathon when it comes to have some lap time challenges to go for any strategy of your very own. So on to session 2 result to have a good calculation by having one sector from the first lap and four sectors on lap number 2. By sector 1 in lap 1 that brings out to have 29.676 seconds along with lap number 2 to go by sector 2, 3, 4, and 5. 24.954 seconds, 14.697 seconds, 16.667 seconds, and 21.224 seconds. Awesome. Match correction and good for the max speed by 180 miles per hour onto the high speed BOP slash tuning prohibited. But the correction, my guess, is going to be on the goal. 2.88% in 20,399 place. It's about time and just yet to have the ranking registration will end in about 4 hours, 26 minutes and 46 seconds until at the end of the day to have a good moment before November is about to be over soon as December is about to be coming in to be set by arrival until Christmas season is about to be prepared. It's about time to have a good best lap replay and just going to stay well defended because the target time is about to go by change on the update for every hour until if I had to be stay on the silver. But after all, just going to come back and practice well that you really might need to have your time to stay well defended on the gold. So here is my extra session for the record by update in 1 minute. 46.836 seconds as I'm about to be moving up in 9,049 place. 31st gold medal by having 2 million GT credits and solid work to be at 24,373,987 GT credits. By having the group 3 category is now yet to be available at Willow Springs International Raceway at the Big Willow. Next up, the short course layout at Watkins Glen International by using the Alpine A110 Premier Edition 2017. It's about time to have two American racetrack with only having Group 3 race cars and one French vehicle is about to have a one good taste of recipe. So I'll have to be ready to wrap this up towards the end of the video. Progress goes by after taking a few months for every two weeks as part of the lap time challenges. Hopefully, the GTWS World Finals and the Manufacturers Cup is about to be set and coming up to be on Saturday until this will be on a date on December 2nd. But it's already midnight because the celebration will always gonna have to keep on going after we have been seen from the Toyota Gazoo Racing GT Cup Grand Final since yesterday. But now, the Manufacturers Cup World Final is about to make the next turn in about 11 hours, 55 minutes, and 30 seconds. As I have some few events in progress will be entered on the World Touring Car 900 and weekly challenges is now being available by participate in 5 events for a week. Thank you for enjoying watching the video on Gran Turismo 7. I hope you enjoyed. Go subscribe to my YouTube channel for a like comment then click the bell for notification on upcoming content videos if you'd like to see. Don't forget to check it out on any social media platforms like Dividend Art, Twitter, Instagram, GT Planet and more for see for my own image artwork like UDRS Delivery, Total Drama Fan Art Ricard Liveries and more whenever you're welcome at any time. I'll be see you guys next time on Gran Turismo 7 and I look forward to see you again in the next video. Keep on racing, stay clean.